Brooklyn Savvy is a show of women talking about issues that are important to women. And that's why I have a panel of women that I think reflect the thoughts and feelings of everyday women living in Brooklyn. Women want to know how to work better together and then how to lead better. I did one show on how women compete in the workplace and I thought that was highly successful because we had to look at where we're weak, where we're strong. I was born a fighter. You know, and, I, and that's possibly what you see. But I was not born secure. Mm -mm. I was bashful, afraid to speak up. And I just said, you know something? You've got to get, you've got to get away from this. So what I would say to young women today is to say yes to things that, you, that you're afraid of and say yes to those things that you may be insecure about because you'll get through it, you'll learn, and you'll get better. That's my belief. <laughs> First of all, black women, as we were talking about earlier, have always been self-sustaining to a, to a point where they've always learned that they had to support themselves, they had to work, they might have been the sole support of their families. Mm -hmm. So now, when you see a, a white man and a black woman, I think there's that natural attraction in terms of she is going to work with him because it's a shared responsibility. That's how I see it. Politics yeah. is, a, is, 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 um, is a sport. Yeah, rough yes. and tumble. It's, it's rough, rough and, tumble. and tumble, man. You yeah. know, I, in fact, I was, mm -hmm. um, I was uh, t talking to a, le a labor leader, and they said, "Tish, you were elbowing me." <laughs> <laughs> and I said, "And I said, well, I had to get to the camera." Right. <laughs> as much as right. this is what leadership can look like. like mm -hmm. This is a this is a young woman, maybe not unlike you, but she's gone to do this in her community. Right. She's made change. So, so this basically, way. it's about accepting the leadership that's within you, not letting society define what a leader is. So Correct. therefore, you can right. then turn around and lead yourself. Correct. Oh, interesting. That was your. Sign. And he was so <laughs> persistent in calling me and calling me. I ran out of so excuses. <laughs> I ran out of reasons yes. not to date him oh, because really? at first I, w I kept telling him, I was very open the first time he right, called me, right. I said, oh, I don't date white people. I wow. just don't do this. This is not me. So he said, okay. And he called me the next day. And we're just talking and laughing. And I went, wait a minute, I'm enjoying this. Hmm, this is really interesting. And then because of my, my religious faith, you know, I had made a commitment to really demonstrate what it means to be an enlightened person. Mm. So how can I talk about being enlightened and I'm closing the door just right. because of the color of a person's skin? Right, right. <laughs> and he said, geez. And I said, well, you know, and he said, most women don't elbow. And I said, well, yeah, but you guys were all standing there. So they were blocking me. And they were blocking right. me. Right. And the only way to get through was to elbow you. Right. And there's, a, there's a, um, um, a sticker, a bumper sticker that I've seen that, that says something like, um, most well-behaved women don't make history. I think the reason I've written all these pieces, and actually now I haven't written a piece for the divorce page in a while, because I, I may be done on the subject, I'm not really sure, but during that period I had all these things that I wanted to say. And I really, and people did say to me, you know, these are so raw, why are you sharing? I mean, I was very nervous about the L piece, because it was about me being arrested for domestic violence during my divorce. It was very, very personal. and I expected people to be kind of mean to me after that piece came out and I was really surprised how many people came up to me and said like that was so amazing and I, I, I really was ex expecting it to be much harder much harder experience than it was